focus. Other seed fell into good soil and brought forth grain. The parable of the sower reflects human life. All of us face obstacles in the life of faith when we try to live the word of God. A pleasure-seeking culture that promotes a spirit of individualism and selfishness is the rocky soil that bears no fruit. We could get so involved in ourselves that we fail to listen to the word of God or seek pleasure in worldly things rather than in building our souls which we need to be good soil for the word of God to flourish in our lives. There are two ways we can become good soil. Either of these recommendations, if practiced sincerely, will work. St. Ignatius recommends we examine our conscience every day and introspect whether our actions are bearing witness to the life of Christ. But St. Augustine comes at this most positively. He says, love and do whatever you please. According to Augustine, let the root of love be within. Of this root can nothing spring but what is good. Instead of constantly asking myself what I am doing wrong, I could focus on how I can love God and neighbor even more. In other words, instead of trying to get rid of rocky areas, I could concentrate on adding better soil. Fruit. How can I show my love for God and neighbor today more than I did yesterday?